So over here, if I were to go around under the OneDrive settings, I'm going to click on the OneDrive icon over here on the taskbar and then click on the gear icon, go to settings right here. Under sync and backup area, you can see that advanced settings is an option. And if you were to click on this, you can go around and scroll down and you can see that files on demand is an option. So what actually happens when you actually work around with files inside of your uh, desktop using the OneDrive app is that everything gets started up to store uh, locally. So everything gets stored locally and it might fill up your hard disk space. And if you want to free up those uh, space right here, then you can click, uh, th then you can click on free up space right here. Once you do that, what happens is that everything frees up. So, uh, all the files that you see will not be inside uh, of your computer. You can still see it, but whenever you go around and access out something, then what happens is that it syncs out, it downloads out the file, and then it accesses that out right here. And you can see that as I click on it, you can see this icon right here, denoting that it is downloaded. The ones that, that has the cloud icon right here is not downloaded onto the computer right here. So if I were to click on it, the file will be downloaded Downloaded and then it'll be opened up after it is downloaded. So this does go around and save up space on your computer. And when you click on free up space right here, what happens is that it deletes out all of those temporary files right here and sends it um, and then it's not locally stored on your computer anymore again. So in order to access it, once you double click, it downloads and open up once again. So what this means is that uh, uh, your local storage stays free and then everything uh, that you have in your cloud will stay there, but uh, uh, won't be deleted. So that is what you can do with the free up uh, disk space option right here. But if you want to download out everything from your uh, OneDrive, then you can click on download all files right here and you can click on continue and it says it will use up space right here. So now if you were to click on continue, what happens is that it'll start out syncing out all of the files onto your local stories. So it'll start downloading and you can see the status right here, just like this. This does take up your disk, uh, disk space, but will speed up your workflow because uh, whatever you work with does not need to be downloaded uh, time and again as you work with it, as you can see right here. And you can see that everything turns green right here, meaning everything is locally stored. And that is how you can utilize the file on demand service to utilize the free up disk space option to free up everything um, uh, from OneDrive. Um, uh, uh, that is to free up everything from your computer and store just in OneDrive or you can download all the files and then make sure that it is stored locally as well as in the cloud for a faster workflow. And that is how you can work with files on demand option inside of OneDrive. So I hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.